everyone welcome to cracking maths with shufia and before starting um, if you are new here then please take a moment to subscribe to my channel and share my videos and uh, please don't forget to give a thumbs up if you find it a useful one so let's uh, get into the topic and before that what to say concept clear there is no fear okay let's get started Dear children, Aji Vidyot Kiki Ase, Ahasun Janilo, Aji Vidyot Zikita Topics Ase, Hikita Topics Hall. Number one, what is an algebraic expression? Number two, constants and variables. Number three, terms of algebraic expressions. Number four, factors of the terms of an algebraic expression. And number five, coefficient of the terms. All right, let's begin with the heading of the chapter itself, which is algebraic expressions. Now, have a look. Two words are here. One is algebra and uh, another one is expression, right? Now, what's algebra? Algebra is um, that branch of math which uh, deals with two types of symbols. Yes, two types of symbols. One is 1, 2, 9 etc or any other number which are constants and another one is x y a or any other uh, alphabets which we usually use in algebra as a variable okay so these two types of symbols are used atia upon the next order which is expression and uh, expression means uh, to express something and when we express it in an algebraic way then this is called an algebraic expression right and here i am writing expression algebraic expression definition of algebraic expression when an expression is represented by algebraic symbols yes what are algebraic symbols constants plus variables and when these are connected by um, these mathematical operators we know these operations are plus minus division multiplication these four operations are there so when an expression is represented by algebraic symbols that means constants and variables and are connected by four fundamental mathematical operators is called an algebraic expression this is the definition of algebraic expression okay so simple thing and um, these are the mathematical operators and this 3 into 2 square minus 1 by 9 this is a numerical expression by numbers and 2x plus 3y plus 9 is an algebraic expression okay children remember we should not confuse algebraic expressions with algebraic equations here you see in the first case um, 7x plus 3 this is an algebraic expression and here no equal sign is there and in this uh, second case you see 7x plus 3 is equal to 2y plus 1 one equal sign is there and so it is called an algebraic equation and in this third case 7x plus 3 is greater than 5 one greater than sign is there and this is an inequality okay so never get confused okay let's uh, uh, explain the terms related to the topic of today dear children let's take an algebraic expression 5 mn minus n plus 7 this is an algebraic expression why because it's a combination of constants and variables and here you see 7 is a constant as it has fixed numerical value and this m and n these are called your variables and uh, as uh, in their place you can take different numerical values so these are called variables and uh, now let's move on terms this 5mn minus n and 7 these are terms and terms are the parts of an algebraic expression which are added yes i'm repeating the word added when uh, to form an expression and um, here you see dear children 5mn is added to minus n then added to 7 to get this expression and uh, so 
uh, these are the terms of an uh, algebraic expression and the next one is our factor yes you see in 5 ml this uh, 5 and uh, this uh, your m and this n these are the factors of our first term and our second term minus 1 and n are the factors and uh, here these factors are also of two types one is numeric factor and another one is your literal factor numeric factor means uh, numbers and this literal factors means these alphabets okay so next one is our coefficient yes now and the, this is the last one and in an algebraic term the numerical factor is said to be the numerical coefficient of or simply the coefficient of the term it is also the coefficient of the rest of the term you see in the first term 5 is the coefficient of mn and uh, in the second term minus 1 is the coefficient of n and this 5 and minus 1 are called numerical coefficient of the algebraic terms okay so children here i am sharing three amazing facts about algebraic expressions uh, number one terms are always separated by plus or minus or both plus and minus but no multiplication no division okay no multiplication no division for example 2x plus 3 2y minus 5 and 70 plus 2b minus 6 etc fact number two in the term in the term we will get only multiplication or division or both multiplication and division but no plus no minus for example 2x x divided by 2 5x by 7 etc fact number three coefficients of the terms may be a whole number a fraction or a decimal number uh, for example 2x plus 3, x plus 3.5y, 5x by 2 plus y. So, children, Aji ami kiki hikilu abar silo summary. Number one, constant which is 7 in this expression. Number two, variable m, n are the variables for first term and n is for second term. Uh, number three, uh, m, uh, five m, n, minus n and seven. These are three terms. Number two, factors five minus one are numeric factors and m, n are literal factors. Number five, 5, 5n and 5m are coefficients of uh, first term and minus 1 is the coefficient of second term. Okay, these are uh, from this algebraic expression 5mn minus n plus 7. So, that's all for today and I hope you all have understood it properly. So, see you in my next video. Till then, stay home, stay safe. Bye-bye.